people of the interweb. Today's video is going up on our 18th birthday. We're officially adults, which is gross. Disgusting. We'll be like this for the rest of our lives. Weird, but so weird. Yeah, but uh, today we've, we're gonna reflect on 18 things we learned in 18 years. Without further ado, let's get into the video. First thing that we learned is something that really has come into play more recently because, you know, coronavirus, that's just like, schools are getting canceled, everything that's, that we've been planning is getting canceled, and also now we've had a teacher strike, things are getting canceled, but uh, when things seem to be like, they can't get any worse, the only thing that can happen is they get better. You might have to like, marinate in the bad for a while, but it takes time, yeah. But the second thing is growing up is scary, <laughs> like reaching adulthood, that's weird, because then like you don't know what you're doing when you're on your own the first time, and you'll adjust, but it's going to be scary for a while. Like all of a sudden, like one day you're a, like a kid, like legally not an adult, and then the next day it's just taxes, lottery tickets. Okay. Next thing we learned is that you'll grow apart from your friends, and it's not always a bad thing. Sometimes it's hard. It's hard for a while, the during, and maybe a little bit after, but you'll always find new friends to complete you and shape you. You'll either learn to deal with it or grow apart and you can't really stop that. The next thing that we learned uh, was we learned to find our passions and for us that was music and is music. Uh, Will be. Yeah, it's past, present, future. <laughs> yeah, it's just a big part of our lives that is not leaving anytime soon. Uh, and it really has changed us for the better, so. Yeah. Shaped us into who we are today. <laughs> it's a real good thing, <laughs> but. Mm -hmm. uh, next, we've found what good friends are. Like, the friends we have now. Yeah, for a long time. Mm -hmm. We didn't have friends, or good friends. People that, like, they just have your back. It might just be as you get older, people become who they're meant to be. Uh, but once you find good friends, you'll have standards. <laughs> Next, uh, we learned to step outside the box a little bit. It's always scary and nerve wracking and like not always an enjoyable experience. Sometimes you might regret it. But like, it's it builds character, if anything. Check that off your bucket list. Next. Working isn't fun. Now, we've always been told that uh, when you get a job uh, in the future, it shouldn't feel like work. Uh, so, as a teenager, part-time job will not be your, your everyday. Yeah, it's know. not usually ever going to be like your passion. It can be a stepping stone, but like, you're not always going to enjoy what you're doing. The next thing that we learned is that if you want something done, you're going to have to do it yourself. This can be applied in many different ways, but like, if something is really important to you and nobody else is going to step up and do it, take the opportunity and like, none of it. Yeah, do it yourself if that's what you really feel like you want. So next is not all good ideas work out. There's such a thing as regret. Uh, like, yeah, it could be something like a haircut, like the, oh, I love hair. Or it could be a relationship. Yeah, a relationship. There's consequences that you might not want to face. But you have to, even when it seems like a good idea in the moment, you have to weigh your consequences. Yeah. You save yourself. Like, don't be afraid to take the risk, but also like be think smart. about it before you do. Um, so the next thing is the awkward phase 
does not last forever. Yeah, it might last a while, and there might be more than one, but eventually your facial dimensions are gonna even out. Yeah, and you're gonna be less lanky. You'll learn how to talk to people and make friends. You'll there's always an adjustment period in any new time of life. Mm -hmm. So yeah, you'll find sometimes, out what's socially acceptable. Yeah. Sometimes you just have to be awkward, but yeah. embrace it. Next, uh, you won't always win. That's a hard one to learn. Yeah, we've always been like really competitive. And we like winning and like being the best at things, but like sometimes you get the short end of the yeah, stick. It's not always gonna happen. Like you can't always be the best, and you have to just like be like don't be a sore loser about it. If anything, you have to learn how to fail in life, or else you won't get very far. Yeah, you're not gonna get everything that you want, and if you do, your first loss is gonna slap you across the face yeah. and make you cry. <laughs> gonna have a hard time with life. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, next, we learn and are kind of still learning as it takes a lot of time to get out of the habit. Procrastination is bad. It's, <laughs> it will really come and bite you when you leave something to the last minute, and then, uh, yeah, people are depending on you, and it's not it's your like, greatest oh, work. Yeah, oh no, I didn't do it. Like, yeah, you'll feel bad about yourself because you know you can do better, but maybe a really bad mark will be um, the like motivation to get your act together. Mm -hmm. Next thing we've learned is that. Family is forever. Yeah, and if we didn't if we didn't learn any of these things, we'd always know that one. Because just our family has always instilled in us that everything like doesn't matter what you have or who you're with, they'll always have your family and they'll always have your back. Uh, this one we've learned uh, it's been kind of apparent recently, and it hit me hard, uh, but you, you won't always be anybody's first choice. Like, if you think about it, other people have other friends that they're closer with, or like, uh, other relationships uh, that just come first, or like, even Sometimes people just they realize they need to take care of themselves first, which is good. Yeah, but it can be hard to see when you're sitting at home uh, doing nothing and your friends are out without you. Yeah. But like, that's a thing that will happen a lot in life. You can't get too salty about it. Yeah, but just know you're not alone and if you really want something like we said earlier, do it yourself. Yeah, if, if you're not their first choice, make them yours. And open their eyes for them. Yeah. Uh, next we have, don't be afraid to like take the picture of that meal or of your friend's stupid looking hair or a nice outfit or like you go to this concert or whatever. Yeah, rather than try to remember the details, you can, like, you have photo evidence, well, video evidence, or whatever. Yeah, and it's just, like, high quality time. And you can always remember that. Um, so, next thing we've learned is that practice makes perfect. And sometimes practicing is hard and it takes a lot of effort to want to actually do it. You might not see the results right away. Uh, and like for us that's in like instruments but that can be in like exercise like weight loss uh, stuff but yeah if you don't practice you won't you won't get any better and it does make you feel better about yourself to see improvement 
and work towards a final goal. Next is have someone or something that makes you happy, whether that's a person, just like an a object, nice book, an object, an animal, high smoke. Find something that creates happiness in your heart. The last thing uh, that we learned in our 18 years is that you don't know when the good old days are until they're over. So you have to make every day worth it. Because you never know when your life is going to change and what you're going to miss. So make memories in the moment. Just make every day a good one. And you'll look back on your life with fondness. <laughs> yeah. Here's to 18. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to like, click here to subscribe, click here to watch another one of our videos. Leave a comment down below telling us one thing you've learned in your life that you think is valuable to share with other people. Uh, yeah, see you in our next video.